Hey guys, so today we're going to be making some southern style collard greens with some smoked neck bones. Yes, I love me some collard greens. And so I, I made this and I ate it with some baked mac and cheese, some oven, uh, oven baked rib tips, and some cornbread. Yes, so please make sure you like, share, and subscribe. And let's get started. I'm going to start by boiling some smoked neck bones. I just got these from Walmart. Um, you can use smoked turkey wings, smoked turkey leg. You don't have to use any meat at all. But um, I love to put meat in my in my greens because honestly, I can eat greens by themselves as a, a meal in itself. But um, choose whatever meat or no meat if you don't want. Um, I'm going to use the glory greens in the bag today, y'all, because I didn't feel like picking no greens. I didn't feel like doing a bunch of washing of greens, and so I am washing these greens in the bag. It says it's triple washed, but I'm going to wash them anyway and pick out ones that don't look as good. And, you know, sometimes they have those big stems in there, so I'm just going to pick out as many of those as I can. And so I am going to use uh, my fruit and veggie wash to do this and um, just wash those really, really well. And then we're going to throw them in the pot after we boil our smoked meat for about 45 minutes. Like I said, I boiled my neck bones for about 45 minutes. Um, and so now I'm just adding some chicken bouillon powder. I used two tablespoons of that just to give it a little extra flavor. And I'm gonna stir that up and then I am going to add some butter. I'm using plant butter today because I have a child who has a dairy allergy. So I'm using some, some dairy free butter, but feel free to use that good old salted butter. And I'm adding a little like cap full of oil. If you got some bacon grease, that'll be perfect in this recipe. But my mom always put a little cap of oil in there, so that's why I'm doing it. Um, and now I'm adding my washed greens to the pot. And so you might not be able to fit all your greens in at once. And so you're going to have to wait for it to wilt down a little bit and then add the rest. But that's okay. Now I'm going to add some of that Mrs. Dash garlic and herb seasoning. Um, it's a no salt seasoning. So I'm not going to add a ton of salt because the pork has salt and then that uh, chicken bouillon has salt. And then I'm adding in this green seasoning, which also has salt um, amongst other seasonings. And so if you find some green seasoning at your local store, I highly recommend uh, using that for your greens. You can also use the one that says beans. Uh, seasoning because it's same ingredients and so I'm adding the rest of my greens on top of that layer of seasoning and then I'm going to add in my second packet of uh, green seasoning and some more Mrs. Dash. This part is totally optional, but I am adding in about a fourth of a cup of Louisiana hot sauce. It gives it a nice little kick. Um, it actually isn't really that spicy, but I also like spicy food, so you might not want to use my judgment, but I do think the hot sauce adds a nice little flavor. Um, and then I'm adding in a little bit of sugar because uh, greens can be bitter sometimes, and so that sugar helps to balance out that flavor. I promise y'all this is not gonna be sweet and it's not gonna be spicy. It's gonna be a nice blend of flavor. And then I am adding in uh, some sliced onions and we just gonna let this boil for about two hours. I checked it about an hour, hour and a half and this is what it looked like. And so I do like to cook my greens a little bit longer. Um, and so I ended up letting this boil or simmer uh, for an additional 45 minutes. And so that was a total of uh, about two hours or so but cook it to your desired tenderness and yes look at these greens y'all yes i love me some good old greens sop it up with some cornbread
this is the finished product love me a good old bowl of greens and i know y'all have heard me say that several times but um serve it with some cornbread some mac and cheese some chicken fish whatever you like with your greens um please make sure you like share and subscribe i hope you guys enjoyed this video and this recipe enjoy bye